The Clementine arrived at Perfleet just after midnight. Maurice Robinson had already arrived and was waiting to collect the trailer. As the containers were taken off the ship and moved to shore, a cargo operator said he noticed a decomposing smell coming from the trailer, similar to waste. Maurice Robinson collected the trailer and drove out of the port. His instructions were to drive to the area of Collingwood Farm in Orset. Instead, Robinson turned into Eastern Avenue in Thurrock after receiving a new instruction. Give them air quickly, but don't let them out. Roman Hughes sent Robinson this message on Snapchat. Hughes was right to be concerned, given the number of people they had smuggled in the trailer. But it was too late. Shortly before 1.15am, Robinson opened the rear door of the trailer slightly. He took a step back and stood there for 90 seconds as vapour rose from the lorry. There's immigrants in the back, but they're, they're all lying on the ground. OK, are they breathing? I don't think so. They're not breathing? I don't think so, no. OK, tell me exactly what's happened. I heard, it, I heard the noise in the back and I opened the door and there's a bunch of them lying. How many approximately? Oh, uh, the trailer's jammed. Uh, I don't know. Tell me approximately how many patients? Uh, 25. 25 patients not breathing? Yeah, yeah. 